Hello, everybody. My name is Andre Money Game Presents, and today we're going to be playing some Europa Universalis 4. Now, if you don't know what this game is, it's basically. It's hard to explain. I don't know. Alright, I'm going to explain this in the best way I can. It's a strategy game in which you. Basically, your goal is to complete all your objectives and take over the world if you wish. <laughs> And as you can see, we have many years here. Uh, a lot of these years are from my mod that I have installed, which is Extended Timeline, I think it is. What we're going to be doing, though, is we're going to be starting with the American Civil War. As you guys know, I'm American. Actually, you probably don't know. I'm American slash Italian, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to do this American Civil War. And we're going to build America up. We're going to make America great again. Alright, guys? Make America great. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is going to be pretty difficult. I'm going to read what it says down here. Civil War rages in North America. The Ooh, no, that's the wrong one. It usually takes... Ow. Got a splinter. That's nice. It usually takes a long time for things to load. Actually, really hurt. Ow. You know, if the game didn't crash, it'd be also amazing. <laughs> Sorry if I sound a little bit stuffy or anything like that. <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. After three years, we got it. That's that's not even the one we wanted. I, I meant the Revolutionary War is what we wanted. American War of Independence. Also known as the American Revolutionary War, the war broke out in 1775, one of the main reasons being the economic po policies enforced by the British monarchy upon its colonies in America. As the war progressed and the colonies gained support by bo of both Spain and France, they eventually proved to have a major impact of on the outcomes of the war. Ah, nice, that was a quick load. So, we're gonna be the USA. Mm, excuse me, way. And we're going to get started. Boop. It's going to be just normal mode. Apparently Miami is right here. Seems legit. I'm just that's just one of the colonies. We're now going to begin to wait seven three seventy three years for it to initialize the game. A lot of waiting in the beginning. Do do yeah it's great absolutely a1 m9 loading screens for days. Well, I guess we can talk about a few things. All right. So, all right. I was I was hoping I could try to board the game into you know loading up faster, like, cause you know like when you you're about to speak and then it just it does something and you're just like oh, I was hoping that it would just like cut me off and start the game, but it it's not gonna give me that pleasure. Screw you two game. Anyways, like I said, I'm. There we go. That's what I meant. I hate. I hate life. Oh my gosh. So first off, what we want to do is we want to convert all these into states. Which is going to be a smart idea. Because that will give us more income. That's the war. 
let's see, one more, which is Georgia. We're going to pause the game. Too many military leaders, eight out of one. My lord. We're going to head make our air our king a general. We just went ahead and made the Continental Congress a general. Because, you know, that's that's how it works. That's what they did in real life. I'm going to go ahead and uh, take a look at our economy. We're making 18 dinars, which is, you know, actually good enough so that we can get some of these guys. Yearly prestige is pretty... Actually, he's really expensive, never mind. National tax mod of actually no, nope, never mind. All right, we're not getting into one of those. So those all are expensive. Let's see, better relations over time or diplo rep. We're gonna go with the better relations over time. We're also gonna go with morales of armies because that's good. Come right here. We need to uh have a more equal fleet of 20 ships I think we have 20 ships meaning I'm pretty sure this will just immediately just no uh, that's that's great and my life all right so what we're gonna do is we're going to enlist privateers Pass the Blasphemy Act, Declaration of Indulgence, Act of Uniformity, that one, that one, that one. Boom, right there, done it, done it, it's, it's done it. Oh, we gotta core all these. We're just gonna do that for now because I don't think this war is going to end anytime soon. We have one army of 42,000 troops. And we have all of this to conquer. It's going to be a lot harder than I thought. First things first, I'm the realist. Let's look at this army composition. 26-11-5. I think what we want to do is bump I don't know what I did. We're going to bump this up to 10. Alright, never mind. We're not, we're not going to bump it up to 10. Actually, what we can do is take one of them. Do that. Select him. Boop. And there you go. We're under the limit. Nice. All these decisions are just being taken in a rapid succession. Alright, now what we want to do is we're going to need allies in this war to help us. So, France. Basically, what we're going to want to try to do is relations. We're going to try to improve relations with France and improve relations with Spain. Maybe even Austria. Basically, what we're trying to do here is we're just trying to get some allies to help us fight over there. While we have to fight over here. And soon, the entirety of America will be ours. Oh my gosh. Natives entering our colonies. So we can either repel them and gain 200 population in Connecticut, and the natives lose 300. We can present a trade. Ooh. And we'll get profit from it, but we'll get one. Or we can allow them to live in peace. And we can assimilate with them. To be honest, I kind of like the extra trade, because that's more tax, but... Yeah, we're going to do that, because I honestly don't care. 
We're not going to just murder them all off. What do you think this is? Historically correct? I mean, wait, what? We're also going to get a bureaucrat leader. We, uh... President Thomas Pickley. We're a constitutional republic. Let's see, what, are, what ships do we have? Six... Six heavies, nine lights, no galleys, and 18 transport. You also need a leader. I think if anything, we're going to give this to George Washington. I feel like he's got it. He's actually only a two-star general against their one. What are you? You're two-star... Yeah. Okay, it seems like we cannot. Oh, it's because first of the month. That's why. And it has to load every single thing. Oh, it's great. I love the first of every month. Go ahead and bump up the speed to three. You're a two star. Two stars and Bowie. Yeah, I think we're just gonna go with George Washington. It doesn't seem like any of these guys have. Let's make a general out of our ruler. All right. Uh, it seems that we. Oh, did we do it? He's not the best. But anyway, we're going to do this. We're going to put George Washington. And we're going to begin moving up north. we got to defend our lands from Newfoundland. The first major battle of the uh, American Revolution is going to begin. We have ports that are blockaded. And those fleets won't be hard to drop. So we're going to send our fleet to take care of them. These guys are going to be heading into the White Mountains. Which is where we're heading as well. Convert provinces to our religion. Mm. We're protestant right now. Some of our provinces lack cores, which we can just do that. Corruption is going up, which doesn't matter. And yeah, I think we're going to need to get rid of some of these leaders, so... We're going to sack you, 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 we're going to sack you. We're going to sack you, and we're going to sack you, Lincoln. It's not Abraham Lincoln, though. There we go, and that handles that problem. We're continuing moving upwards while our navy continues to move down to engage. Hopefully they stay there. Yep, looks like we're gonna be looks like we're gonna be engaging them. The fleet is also going to be engaging in a bit. We just gotta wonder which battle is gonna go first. Or are they both gonna go at the same time? Mmm. Hey, that's pretty good. And we gotta wait the first of the month. It's already, you know, we just started and we're already kicking off with some heightened drama. About to get into two large battles. Oh, it's about to go down, I tell you. It's about to go down. And I'm not the one yelling timber. I tell you that. And it started. The battles have begun. Over here. 33 verse 13. 40 verse 15. It seems like the battles are going relatively well on our side. We've uh, killed off a lot of them already. They had 16k to begin with. 